this weird looking fish is the barrel eye. And yes, it is a real fish. It can be found pretty widely in most tropical or temperate areas of the Pacific, Atlantic, and Indian Oceans. It's a relatively deep sea fish, so it tends to spend most of its time between 400 to 2500 meters below the surface. They are a relatively small fish, mostly averaging between 6 inches to around a foot, usually right in the middle of their around 8 or so inches. Now on to the most obvious weird thing about this is its head. It is almost entirely transparent. And the eyes are deep set inside what is basically a glob of transparent soft tissue. Now, most of the time, the eyes are pointing directly upward, so instead of looking forwards like most things do, it basically just looks up. That is in order to be able to see prey above it easier, because it's a lot easier to see a silhouette of something swimming above you when there's light to contrast than it is looking directly at it where there's not really any light to contrast. Now, it was thought for a while that the eyeballs only pointed up, but it has since been discovered that they can rotate them forwards to be able to see forwards, which is useful to see where you're going, um, even in the deep sea where you don't really need to because there's not much stuff to run into, but most of the time it is pointing up in order to see the prey better. Now, there are actually multiple hypotheses as to what function that this transparent dome serves, including but not limited to acting as a lens in order to help better move light into the eyeball. It also may serve to protect the eyeballs from the nematocysts or stinging cells of certain jellyfish or siphonophores because it has been observed that the barrel eye will steal prey from jellyfish or siphonophores that are wrapped up in the tentacles or stinging cells or what have you. So this fish sometimes steals prey from those and it does not want to be stung by the stinging cells, especially in the eyeballs. In addition to having that weird head, some species, but not all, are also weakly bioluminescent, which means they have light-producing organs on them produced by symbiotic bioluminescent bacteria. Not a whole lot is known about barrel eye reproduction. It's hypothesized that they are spawners, so basically j they just release the gametes out into the water and let the water do the fertilization for it, but it is noted that the larvae of the fish likely are less deep water than the adults. They usually spend their most of their time in the shallow water, and then when they mature to adults, they descend lower. So this is a very, very strange looking fish with a bunch of very neat adaptations.